What's going on, everyone? Right now, we are on our way to my buddy's house. Unfortunately, he had a little plumbing situation. He caused his basement to flood. Fortunately, though, it was very fortunate. He, was, he wasn't he was too far away. He was able to get that uh, flood under control. Majority of the damage has uh, been done to cheat rock carpet that's been already uh, pulled from him. So I'm just bringing you guys on along for a ride to see what we're working with. All right, guys. So we got the carpet, upholstery for the carpet. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get this in the trailer. A pipe burst and we had a rainfall situation in the basement. Yeah, we'll show them the damages. This is just part of it. I needed somebody to haul it away. I called the only person I knew could handle the job. Priority hauling, jump for moving. Yep. If you don't know, now you know. All right. All right. Ooh, okay. So here's the waterfall, um, or where it was till we ran dry. Uh, temporary solution. Temporary. Using shark bites to get some water running again. Shark bites? Yeah. So this is, uh, the, that's the shark bites right there? Yeah. So the part that broke, it looks like it was used to set up this basement when they renovated. Okay. Um, this area needed, I guess, a pipe, and they kind of tapped into the main and went over there. And oh, for the plumbing here. Yeah, it gotcha. separated. It pulled out of the joint, the coupler. And you can kind of tell it separated. If you look at the brace there, on the other side, you can see that the line shifted over this way. So when, that, when it shifted out of the coupler, it just started leaking out. It was like a hole before we even got to rip it down. There was a hole where the water was blasting through. Well, when that malfunction, yeah. it basically beat a hole through the sheetrock yeah. and on down. Was, ah. Think about, think about how, hard, how hard that is. Yeah, that's some thick sheetrock. The water be pushing through it. That's some thick sheetrock. It blew a hole through as if. It was a hole that was cut before. Ah, man, that was some uh, some serious oppression. Well, luckily, uh, it was hot before anybody went to work. And, oh, yeah. But it, was, it was still enough to cause the carpet to get there. All right, so we got carpet removed. But then, you will see about like this over there. And, uh, okay, so we got to remove that, too. The up to right about here. But the rest of the stuff, I think the water didn't get above the baseboards. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So it, it didn't get, it didn't get above. Gotcha. So it was, yeah, it was, it was just like, you couldn't tell there was water until you stepped in the carpet. Gotcha. Yeah, I remember like seeing that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we moved everything off the carpet, rolled it up, took the insulation out. That was the most wet thing ever. Gotcha. Got it in, this, in the tub, let it drain. And then now we're going to just replace the entire carpet, set up whatever stripping, I guess, needed to be. Replaced. Yeah, but yeah, I think the most of the damage is in the bathroom because the water was splashing over. The yeah, stuff. so every you got you. so everything else is just more so just carpet and floor. Yeah, yeah. And floor, you know. uh, that's not bad. It's not bad. Very fortunate. Very fortunate. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there's not much money that big damage to be impossible. As you guys see, so we're gonna get everything loaded up, and uh, we'll chit chat with you guys later. What do you guys tell them? Tell them to say peace. We made some progress. We went from here to here. All right. <laughs> you know, we 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 barely made it out the door. This thing is this thing is heavy. But and it's, it's like this section right here is like a a, a dead end. Just not maneuverable. We're about to make it for real quick. Exactly. So if if you guys have a you know any type of flooding that saturated a carpet, and you're having difficulties trying to transport the carpet out the door, or just moving in general, highly recommend just drywall. Dr drywall. Cutter. Drywall cutter. Yeah, drywall knife. Um, yeah, drywall you knife. See the blades cuts through like butter, as you can see. Oh yeah, that's only been doing through. it for like a couple seconds. That you watch this. Exactly. Just look at that. It slices, it dices, and that's three layers thick. Three layers, thick. okay, guys. Three layers of carpet that we're cutting up. All right. This is the old dude one. The Milwaukee's man. Oh yeah, the Milwaukee's are the uh, the, the best of the best out there. So they getting tired, is it? 
Let me see what we got. Yeah, get in there, man. All right, guys, here we go. Here's the test. Oh, yeah, she cuts like oh, butter. Okay. All right, all right. I was, I was cheating, guys. I was cheating. I was doing two layers. That last bit. There we go. You barely did that. All right, guys, I'll be back. Okay, I gotta do some work. All right. Putting the customer to work, Yeah. Putting the customer to work. This is this is a rare occurrence that you guys see that I actually have a customer doing the job. Oh, let me get that door for you. Let me get that go for you. You know? Yeah. There we go. Just being a, you know, being a gentleman to the customer, you know, got, got, got to help the customer out. <laughs> yeah. So guys, we got one side of the carpet. Now we just got to toss this on. Then the other carpet is inside. And we got the mattress on inside as well the mattress is gonna be tossed over that and uh use the tarp to keep everything on and uh use the straps strap everything down all right be back with you guys later all right so this is the other carpet got another piece there and then we got the mattress and uh, the job will be done. So if you got any, uh, you know, if you basement gets flooded or anything of that nature, give me a call and uh, I'll stop by. Get this outside real quick. Two. I gotta get a uh, new wheelbarrow one day. I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of those. Toss the bad boy up in here. All right, so we're gonna put the other one here. I think the other carpet's gonna be heavier than this, but cutting it up definitely helps. So we may do another cut, we'll see. But uh, yeah, she's back, baby. Time to work. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let me. All right, guys. Here's the update. Everything's been removed. Far as the carpet, as you can see, there's no carpet on the floor, uh, and the mattress is also gone. So, well, if you have anything else. Yeah, yeah, we 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 we, we, we just we can haul all this away. Yeah, we're gonna go. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'll just I, 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 all right. We we could do that. I'll, I'll take the wallet. I'll take the stuff, and we we're good. We're easy. <laughs> all right, guys. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching. So everybody, say peace. Peace.